A viral post on social media is doing great things for the foster care community. The post encourages you to donate your used luggage to foster care agencies instead of taking it to places like Goodwill or throwing it out. Many times when children are removed from their homes, they take their belongings in trash bags. 32's Now reporter Adriana Dalba spoke with one organization about the common problem. It's something many of us might take for granted, a suitcase. But for children in foster care, this bag can make a huge difference. It's something many people are realizing for the first time after this post went viral on Facebook. It's urging people to donate old suitcases to foster care organizations because oftentimes these children move from place to place using trash bags to keep their belongings in. It's an issue Joy Rio says happens far too often. She's the founder of Connect with a Wish, a nonprofit group that helps foster children in Virginia Beach. You want them to come in with the dignity of not just walking in the door with nothing, like that they own something because everything's been taken. So it's a big deal. That's why Rio started packing go bags for the children. Each kid will get a blanket in the bag. She stuffs these duffel bags with everything they'll need as they make that difficult transition into a new home. We just got these in. These are awesome. We fill them here and then we take them to human services. Rio says the viral post has led to a spike in people reaching out to her organization. The awareness of people looking at that and not knowing what that means or for the first time even thinking about what foster care means is huge because uh, it takes a village and these kids and a foster parent and a social worker is just not enough. We need to be the community around them to kind of pick up these pieces to give them what they need to be successful in life. Something as simple as a bag can go a long way during what may be the most difficult moment in a foster child's life. In Virginia Beach, Adriana de Alba, 13 News Now.